Okay. Story time. Today at league practice, we were playing a couple of games of draft before the practice was over because we had to play, got to play more games. I needed my Morgana to get more practice on her. And we were losing real bad because everybody was just inting. Coveted price. Not bad. Not good either, though. And so, in my pursuit to play, I was playing Diana because I was like, I'm going to learn how to play Diana. I, we're, we're not going to end that hard, right? Well, my top laner goes 0 and 4 to a Quinn in the early game. And my bot lane is not close to even, and they banned my teammate or my our randoms Yasuo because they thought it was funny, but then he played as real mid and he was getting bodied. So I was I don't I couldn't play the game. And Quinn was Quinn took two tower shots topside and she was cruising around through my jungle taking my camps and I was like ah I dashed Q dashed did did all my stuff is got into an extended fight with her and she was running away and I was like no she's gotta live. But then I remembered the wise words of Aragon Chase. If you flash sideways, the Q will extend the distance. And I did it. And I got him. But then I realized, well, there's a Craig Blake battle off. It's nothing. Then I realized, well, I can never tell him now because then he'll know that he was right. And I can't have that happen. So it... Hopefully he never sees this video. If he does, hi, Aragon. If not, who knows? By the way, we have like $3 worth of value in this pile. All of the rares that we've pulled have been doo-doo, kaka, terrible. Spoils. Could be our takedowns. Kind of neat. Orin Reef Ooze used to be cool. It's not anymore, though. Okay, fine. This is probably the card that's worth the most in this entire... Well, besides, besides our land, we've got one good one. One good one is neat it's kind of a plus one plus one counter payoff okay that's about it i just need to tell you story time bye bye